consider, as an example, a function f from R2 to R3. How can we write the inclusion function for f? f becomes inclusion function, so I write it with brackets. Here I go from IR2 to IR3, I mean from the set of boxes of R2 toward the set of boxes of R3. And I replace these numbers by intervals. And here again, I use interval operators. So interval arithmetic. We have now the natural inclusion function, bracket f, which is associated to the function f. Now we have a theorem for Moore which states that if in each subfunction of f, so in each coordinate function, each variable occurs at most once, then we have the minimal inclusion function. What is the minimal inclusion function? I have a function f from Rn to R. I take a box and here I have the image box. If the inclusion function f is like this, the inclusion function is not minimal. If I have the smallest box which contains the image box, then I have the minimal inclusion function. So the Moore theorem tells us that if each variable occurs at most once, then I will have the minimal inclusion function.